Hey, it's the two T's. Hey, and Ashley in Super Mario Awesome. We started the game and beat the final level of World 1. Uh, and so, it's about time Bowser was mentioned. Eh. Anyway, it's time for and a new world. world two. With time One, for a, a new, new world. In World 2. You'll know something similar between World 2 and World 1, I'm sure. They're pretty much very similar in structure. They have a lot of short levels. The only thing is World 2's levels are a lot harder. Yeah. Especially the later World 2 levels. Yeah, late, as I said, late World 2, it gets hard. And I don't know, this parkour area can probably kill some people. Yeah, I was thinking that that parkour could really stress someone out. Especially because if you get hit by those things, you might die, depending on your power-up and how good you were before. Yeah. And time to touch this. Yeah, yep, yep. yep. That was easy. And anyway, next so up for Underground Adventures. This one actually does require you to find a secret exit, but I'm going to do what a lot of people would consider probably doing first. Um, so, yeah. Yeah, yeah. For, yeah so... First, I'm just going to do the normal exit, which is the way you shouldn't go. I'm going to show you yeah, guys especially how Especially to... because as, as it's an almost unrecognizable way to get to the secret exit. I, uh, this is the one good secret I have in this entire thing, really. Yeah. So, despair, kill that guy. <clears throat> Ow. Run! I'll give you a hint. That... Hablock, those Hablocks back there have something to do with it. Okay, now, bum, bum, if bum, I can make bum, a successful, bum, bum, oh, bum, bum, oh, bum, bum, bum. like a beast. Like a beast. Okay, yes, yeah, so that's the way you shouldn't be doing this level. I might as well just play the other level just to show people what hap um, the level you'll be doing if you do that Screw way. Screw up. Flying Yoshi. Yeah, this is a level where you need to completely fly on Yoshi. I think you can only get hit once, even if you have, like, a really good power-up. So this level is very difficult at times. Yeah, but at other times, if you know what you're, if you know what you're doing, it's easy. Like, that's, that's really how you can summarize basically this entire game. If you know yeah. what you're doing, it's easy. If you don't, it's really hard. No world do no world says that better though than world two. Yeah, because of this level. Well, actually, I'd say level and before. later levels. I mean, yeah, I mean, pretty much almost every world um, is an example of that, but none knew it better than world two. Yeah. Okay, um, yeah. So, um, as you can see, we now go back around here, and I guess I should show everyone how they're supposed to do it now. Yeah, it's through a secret ladder. That is really a hard to find. And it's really a vine. And the way you're and the way you have to find it is actually really difficult to um si to side out. And we do actually need that one Koopa from earlier. You need a shell. And you that guy doesn't count because he dies. He like glitch deaths there. Okay, now go back here to grab that. You can grab some shrooms here, and you need to kick a Koopa into that block. Okay, so we need we do I need bet this Koopa guy. has homing AI. Yeah, so what you need to do is you need to find a way to be able to jump on him, so you can get to his shell. Ow! Dang, I am doing like really bad right now. It's what I call the let's play disease. Where, like, or the Let's Play Curse. I've heard the term Let's Play Curse used a lot more often. I kind of call it the Let's Play Disease, but uh, it doesn't matter what people call it. It's basically the same thing. And you kick that, and then you have to go up here. And avoid the parent hoopas. I like uh, to jump up ladders. And when you do this, you have to go over here. Take the key from Birdo. I like to throw it over, because sometimes if you mess up the jump, it's impossible. And you have to go to the queue. <laughs> See, that's how you manage to get um, further into World 2. Yeah, and you manage to get to the... Toad house. Toad's, Toad's crappy home. Yeah, Toad's crappy home. It really is crap. 
Okay, one thing. Don't go down this pipe I'm standing on. It's a death trap. I did. Oh, yeah. By the way, Toad is a freaking troll. Oh. If anybody knows a way I can make it so I can kill Toad, can someone please tell me? Well, that? you can eat him if you don't program any text to him. Hmm. I might consider that next time, because I am going to make yeah, more you, maps. Yeah, he, he acts as a mushroom if you if you don't program any text to him. Yeah, that boss kills himself. Just yeah, that I I actually made that mistake in level ma in arena making in, in arena in arena simulation in it was so time to go X. down this pipe and go up and platform panic. Kick. This is actually platform the level panic. where this is actually the first of the really hard levels in my opinion. Yeah, uh, and You'll probably have the definitive opinion as the creator of the game. Yeah, in my opinion, this is de definitely the first level where it actually took me a while of testing to be able to beat it. Yeah, testing, testing, one, two, four. Hey, seriously, it, it took me a while to be able to beat this, but the raccoon power-up, without it, it, this level is incredibly difficult. Keep the raccoon power-up, whatever you do. Yeah. Um, Unless you happen to be skilled enough to beat it without it, which would be insane from, at least from my standards, because this level without the raccoon power-up is just really overly difficult. Okay, now we have to wait for... Oh! Oh, boy. Oh, I almost made a really oh, stupid decision. Uh, 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 the Super Mario Bros. 3 athletic scene, constipated version. And yeah! It's the constipated version. Um, so yeah, um... Super Mario ooh, themes, the constipated version. Um, up, up you go. This level's actually... It, if you know how to do it properly, this it's level is... It's freaking easy. If you don't know, though, it's actually pretty hard, I guess. Yeah, it's... yeah. Still it's, not the hardest level. It's, even like, really freaking easy. It's actually not even the hardest level of World 2, to be honest, if you know what you're doing. Yeah, it's probably the easiest if you know what you're doing. And I, to be honest, this was the easiest time I had with a level in World 2. Yeah, World 2, to be honest, is when it actually starts getting difficult. Oh, gosh, I hate the Fortress, but I'm going to do it anyways. Yeah, the Fortress is optional, oh, but... I, um, actually, um... When uh, Nick tested it, yeah, this wasn't here. Um, that's because, actually, um, Nick, after I started creating World 4, it actually somehow got deleted, so I had to restart making all of the worlds and everything. Oh, man. So that really did suck, but... I um, Does it, World 4 still look like a crappy Fire Emblem map? Yep. <laughs> cool. Oh, crap, I forgot. You can't regular jump while holding stuff. Bad Spike! Ah, uh, you suck, Red Platform! You almost let me skip uh, half the level. Spike. Half the level. Okay, you need to spin jump because for some reason when you're holding things, it doesn't let you normal. It's an jump. X thing. Yeah, uh, it's a Super Mario Bros. X thing that really It's a does... Symbix thing. Oh. Oh. <laughs> what was that? Okay, well. As you can see, I am just vibration noises. As you can see, um, I am just small Luigi now in a very hard level. This level is very hard. If I remember correctly, you can only be Mario or Luigi in this, right? Yeah. To be honest, to be honest, the best character for a level like this would probably be Peach. Yeah. If if you were able to play as Peach, you'd be the best character for this. Yeah, but unluckily, that's only in regular Mario X. And here's just a Mario and Luigi adventure. You know what, guys? Um, that might be all the time we have. Okay, let's... Actually, we still have around five and a half minutes. Ah, uh, crap, I really hate this level, but I have to do it. You have to do it for the fans. I... For yourself. For the life of... Yeah, this is definitely the hardest level in the For the, the life of Actually, in the entire Roy. game, this is probably the hardest of the levels. The hardest of the levels. 
the hottest of the levels. <laughs> yeah, this really is. I do really hate this episode with a passion. I mean, I do really hate. Oh, okay, that was lucky. This level. Yeah, this level was a. Did you design this? Yes. <laughs> Why did I design this crap? Yeah, I mean, like some of these levels weren't made by you. I know. Uh, yeah, as well as I think why I made this crap. Yeah, what were you thinking when you made this crap? Okay, well, um... Everybody, I'm gonna go level grind! See you!